Finn from the Gaming Bros. And today we're going to do a TNT can tutorial. As you can see over there, there's one over there and one over there. But those recordings had no sound, sadly, because I completely messed it up. Wow, Finn, that's a fail, I know. So, the first thing you want to do is set up a 3 by 10 or a 3 by anything, really. But I recommend 3 by 10, 3 by 9, or 3 by 8 because those are the things that are going to get you the most power. So you just make that. I'm going to do a 3 by 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Actually, just do a 10 to make it easy for myself. So then you just set it up like the 3 by 10. Like this. Then you want to add blocks. Make it exactly too high on every single block. Except what the end block where you want the TNT to shoot out of. Hold on. So you want to make it almost like a U. I think I'm seeing someone's like a weird long U. And you want to do that another time. It's supposed to be too high. Like, just like this. Then, what you want to do is, you want to put down a trap door. Make sure it's like that. And you want, if you put it like this, it's going to explode. But it's going to go really far and it's going to probably explode in the air. So what, for me, to be able to hit the village over there, which is what I'm trying to destroy, I put it down like this. Then at the end over here, you put down a water bucket so that the TNT doesn't distort the cannon. As you can see, it just makes it over there. That's why I did 10, because it can only go eight blocks until it happens. Then what you want to do is on one of the sides, it doesn't matter actually, put redstone to, not to the last block, but to the second to last block and put it all the way down to the end like that. Um, and then on the other side, you want to put a redstone down, just one block here. Put in a bunch of redstone repeaters. And then another piece of redstone. And you want to make sure that these are on the last setting, the, the redstone repeaters. So that it holds back the redstone so it doesn't immediately do it. All these should be able to hold it back for about 4.5 seconds or 3 seconds something like that and just put a block of diamond here or whatever block you want recommended something hard and I've pressed this button as you can see the redstone will wait and this is exactly the outline for the TNT cannon now all you have to do left is just load up the TNT it should be on the second block so it's not sitting and blocking at the water if it does then you just ruined your day press the button the TNT, as you can see, that one will launch before that one, and that will destroy. Now, sadly, I didn't make it so it, to the village, so I wonder if I put it up like this, if it will uh, make it to the village and possibly actually destroy something. Well, it destroyed something before. <sighs> Sorry, it's raining out. I can't really control that. I forgot how to. As you can see, when I did it up high, I did it, but the problem is, is that it, I didn't make the thing wait long enough. So there's probably gonna be a way, maybe, I doubt this works, I don't think this works. If it did, that'd be great. Actually, I think you can do this with the redstone, com eh, redstone comparator. I'm not sure, but I'm hoping you can do this where you can like, set it up like this yeah so I think that will work I'm not sure though so don't ask me I'm just gonna check out if it works because that would oh and then I have to put this on the very last setting if you even has one no it does not sadly so I want to see if this works better for even works if I'm just gonna completely waste my time but I just already showed you how to make a simple one but I'm wondering if this actually works no, it does not, so do not do that. Well, I showed you how to make a simple one, and I hope I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't add that stupid comparator thing right there. It completely ruins it. And I hope you enjoyed the video, as I said before. 
click the like button below and please subscribe i would really enjoy that i haven't this is probably one of the first videos i've ever made so i hope you like it and let's just watch the tnt Boom. thanks for watching see you next time with the gaming bros da, da, da.